Hey guys, I Heart Movies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Lunar 2 Eternal Loot Complete. In the last episode, we just uh, picked up all the chests around the vein, and then we began exploring the uh, Sluice Forest, and I cleared all the enemies off screen, except for one which I'm going to show right about now. Let's see, we have the Blood Bird that's a birdie in the back. Um, it's, kinda, it's just like it's, uh, it's a cousin of um, the one bird we fought way back in the Starlight Woods and the Illusion Woods. Um, still has. Actually, pretty much the same attack. So when you see it's flapping its wings like that, it's gonna do the HP draining attack just like before. So I wanna try and take those out first, if at all possible. I don't think that we did anything, but I'm just gonna have Hero just go ahead and use Post Sword. Um, Ron Far, just attack the middle thingy. Uh, Jean, go Dream Dance. Uh, Lamina, any chance uh, Ice Arrows would work? Uh, no, let's try Flame Shot. No. Well, I'll show up Ice Team, because I haven't shown that off yet. And, no, oh, maybe I will level up at the end of this battle, maybe not. I haven't checked my status for a little while, so I really don't know. And, yeah, well, 44 damage, not that bad. 53, okay, that's a little worse. But still, that's really about all they do. Then they have their standard physical attack, which deals a little less damage than that. So, that's really about it. Nothing really too hard about it. I just, I just wanted to show them off real quick is all. Ow. Ow, back attack, that was cheap. Yeah, stuff from Twitter. Yeah, apparently my whole tw uh, Twitter feed is ablaze and just going crazy with apparently with uh, 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 Nintendo Capri Sun apparently being hacked today or whatever. Um, from what I've seen, um, I've I'm seeing some people say he has been. Other people are saying his videos uh, uh, his videos have just been privated. I really don't know. I haven't checked at all. I'm always hoping he hasn't been hacked at all. Does that would suck? So um, no one. I just. I had no one knows what's going on except for NCS himself, so. Well, hopefully that situation is resol resolved soon enough. And yeah, I want to heal up real quick. That's all the enemies around here. I took care of the rest of them off screen, so we're good to go. And chest starlight. And see, there's one more chest over here off to the left, which I remember contains a very, very, very important item the Warrior Crest. Pretty much what that does, it does what you think it does, raises your attack by 10, and it lowers your wisdom. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Let's see, this would be a good fit for either Gene or Hero. Oh, no, no. For Hero, yeah. <coughs> excuse me. Jeez. Yeah, I think it's a better fit for Gene because I think Wisdom it doesn't apply to our dances at all. I, I don't believe it does. And she is a little bit weaker than Gene and uh, Ron Fart, so the Warrior Crest is good for her. But most importantly, um, if you kept the Seal Crest up to this point, um, you'll be glad you did because there's a Crest combo we can do with the Warrior Crest and the Seal Crest. Holy crap, look at that attack power. It raises it by 81 points, but it disables magic and techniques, but yeah, it grants full attack power. So this only gives Gene one attack, but it's gonna be more than twice as strong as our normal attacks. For random battles, I recommend not using that combo, but we will be using it for some bosses later on, but not right now. So just keep her on the Warrior Crest for right now, and then as it's, when the time comes, I'll get with the Seal Crest. So just keep that around, just make sure you don't sell it or anything. And with that, let's progress north, and we're done with the part already, actually. I don't know, Athena statue right over here, thankfully. Um, there's no chests around here either. you think that the, uh, the game would tuck one, or, uh, tuck one away somewhere, but no, there's not. And, oh crap, we... Are we gonna be able to cross? Uh, I guess not. Oh, it's not that far. And yeah, who would be controlling the flood anyway? Yeah, why is it closed? That sucks. And how would you know that? Did you feel the water? Maybe it's warm. Oh, well, that's nice. I'll open it by tomorrow morning. Okay, well, that works. But yeah, again, who's going to open it? Oh, okay. Well, scary stories! Yay! And where are the stories? Stories were a lie. Apparently. And <laughs> we did not need to know that, but thanks for sharing. Now get in my belly, nom 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 nom. Oh, that's weirdly sensitive of you, Ron Far. Oh, by like tomorrow there. Wow. By like tomorrow we should reach Pentagulia. Alrighty. And yeah, I guess I never thought of that, but once you get to Pentagulia, I guess that's pretty much it. And yeah, this is nice. This is nice. Uh, retro. Uh, not retrospective. Just a. This whole scene here is just a nice look back on everything that's pretty much happened so far. 
Yeah, I would think you still would be. That happened like 10 minutes ago. Oh, how nice of you. And of course, Hero's blushing. Uh, of course. And yeah, I'd agree with that. She's definitely... Well, yeah, for singing for one thing, she just seems more down to earth. I guess you want to put it that way. Just seems more like a normal human being. Yeah, I guess it is a good idea. Probably go to sleep right now. But of course, since we're RPG characters, we're insomniacs. And wait, where's Lucia? What was that? What was that? Is that... What was that? Huh. Um, I, I, I would assume no one else knows where she is as they're all asleep. I'm just going to talk to anybody real quick just because you have funny dreams. What? <laughs> um, you guys can probably figure out what he means by fuzzy dice. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's talk to Gene. Hi, Gene. How's it going? Okay, that wasn't funny at all. Um, yeah, I guess you are short. Well, we have, like, over 2,000 silver, so... Huh. Well, let's head up north. I don't think we can naturally leave, can we? Yeah, Ron Farr's blocking the way. Thanks a lot, fat ass. No, just kidding. No, yeah, let's go up here and see what that noise was that I still hear. <coughs> ah, excuse me, jeez. <clears throat> That was a nice view. Nice, clear, starry night. Oh, there's Lucia! And there's Hero, and bad things are about to happen, aren't they? She's naked! Hero, look away, it's rude! Or... Oh, she's sitting again. You know, that's so unbelievably rude of you, but also unbelievably hilarious. Need your freak out in five, four, three, two, one, now. Who's there? Who do you think? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Way to go, hero. You think here should mention this portable camera he has on him? Nah. I don't think so. It's a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, who, who else do you think is going to be Hero? It's going to be Borden, isn't it? Oh, dear God. No. Just, just, no. Well, sadly, in a way, yes. I won't reveal as to what. Let's just say there's something of Borden that we'll see in the future that we won't want to see in the future. I'm still leaving it at that. And anyway, yeah, Lucia actually seems to be embarrassed. She wasn't before, but she is now. You have changed. Dun, dun, dun! Anyway. Well, that wasn't awkward one admit now, was it? Yeah, now where's Ron Far? Oh, God, no. Not again. No, 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 no. Just okay. Awkward. <laughs> nice ton slip, hero. Very nice ton slip. Oh, all right. The water's been drained. Fantastic. So, city of Azado is now within reach. Yay! And then we're almost at Pentagruli already. Wow. Yeah, well, let's get let's get it going. And we have fully healed from our sets to page, and it's a building over there that we can't quite get to. Well, we'll be back there much, much later in the game, so don't worry about it for right now. We will be back soon enough. And nice happy la la music. Well, nice statue. Can't really tell what it is. Though, once you get inside, we can look around and then we'll see what it is. Hey, head, head to the shrine and see an old acquaintance. Alrighty then. But before that, we gotta go exploring for some items. And talk to people, of course. See, down here we have a life jewel. Yay! I think that there's only three chests around here. So let's go ahead and get them all. Let's see, this chest over here, we get the safety helmet. That's for, I think, Hero and Ron for, I believe. Yeah, it's actually better than a steel helmet. I'm actually kind of surprised at that. 
But yeah, I want to give that to Hero for right now, because that will actually play a very key part in a boss fight later on. Yeah, for some reason, the safety helmet is uh, it's uh, resistant against fire. I don't know why, but it is. Let's see. Uh, yeah, we want to head back here through a almost secret passage. Sneak around back here for an angel rain. Now, I didn't mention this before. Uh, for the angel rain, once you equip it and it activates, like once you die and it revives you, um, it breaks. So you can't use it again, actually. So I forgot to mention that before. A, us a user told me about that. So thanks for, for thanks for the tip there. And I think that's about it for today's episode, guys. So next time, let's play Lunar 2 Eternal Blue Complete. We will begin exploring the city of Azado and hopefully make arrangements for a ship to Pentagulia. This has been Iron Movie signing off, guys. Have a nice day and thanks for watching.